Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about rational expressions. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, p plus 4 over p squared plus 6p plus 8, and we need to simplify this and state the excluded values. Well, first step to simplifying is I'm going to look at my denominator and see if we can factor this. Now, some form with the p's here, and we ask ourselves, what two numbers multiply to be 8 but add to be a positive 6? And that's going to be a 2 and a 4. We got a plus 2 here and a plus 4 right there. So as we're simplifying, we can see the plus 4, or p plus 4 and p plus 4 here cancel out. Cancel that out, and we keep going. We're left with a 1 in the numerator, and we have a p plus 2 in the denominator. And so great, we've simplified this expression, 1 over p plus 2. But we need to state the excluded values. And normally, you just look at the denominator with a rational expression and set it equal to 0, and you see what value for p comes up. But we have to include our original problem before we simplified. So we take our denominator, the p squared, plus 6p, plus 8, and we're going to set it equal to 0 from the original to find which values for p cause our denominator to be equal to 0. Well, we've already factored that. That's a p plus 2 and a p plus 4. And then from there, we can set each part individually equal to 0. p plus 2 equals 0, and a p plus 4 equals 0. When solving for p, our p, we subtract 2 to both sides, would be a negative 2, and subtract a 4, be a minus 4. And so the two excluded values here are negative 2 and negative 4, and our simplified expression is 1 over p plus 2, and that is our final answer. I hope this video was helpful for you, and if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math.